Hi there. Today I'm going to show you how to successfully recover an old or outdated website project. Perhaps your website was created in an older version of RapidWeaver or you haven't touched it in some time. As you can expect, when you open this project file in RapidWeaver 8, there's some things that you'll need to adjust to make sure it publishes successfully. In my case, I had a client reach out and they had some updates they wanted to make. I opened the file in RapidWeaver and you can see there's a lot of notices that appear. The first one is RapidWeaver is going to upgrade my project file to the new format. There's another notice saying that the project theme is missing. As you can see here, it tells me what exactly the theme name is. So I'll go ahead and write this down for later use. For now, simply select Apply Theme and Open. RapidWeaver is presenting more helpful tips in successfully uh, reestablishing this project. The new RapidWeaver project was created, and now we have some other uh, tips. In this case, I simply need to relink resources. This is to ensure that when I publish the website, no images or links are broken. All you have to do is scan the folder of where your website is located. Simply select Open, and you can see RapidWeaver stated the file is accessible. Simply close out of this. Another uh, warning that I see is RapidWeaver is unable to load all pages in the project. Here it says these are the plugins that we're currently missing. I'll go ahead and write these down and install these from the developers. And this will resolve this issue. I can also go to the pages that are missing and I can search the RapidWeaver community uh, for these plugins or I can simply delete the page. This will allow me to publish the website. Lastly, there are a lot of stacks on this website. As you can see, there are some stacks missing. But if I go to the inspector panel, it doesn't show exactly which stack is missing. Well, there is a little trick for you to see in the code what stack is on each page. Simply go to Preferences, go to General, and make sure that Enable Web Developer Tools is enabled. Once you're done, go to, let's just say, the home page and select Preview. Now obviously the website's probably not going to look how you'd expect because we still need to get the right theme in. For now, let's just focus on which stacks are missing. Simply right click and select Inspect Element. Here you can see any stack code that is being loaded. You can also go to the live website here. Right click, select Inspect Element and go to head and expand that and scroll down. Here you'll see all the stacks that we've used. You can see which version I had installed when I published this and the different add-ons. So you can see here this is from Joe Workman, it's the Houdini stack. This is from RapidWeaver Central and it's the Design Thing stack, the flat button stack. And so you can see the developers go to the developer websites and download the appropriate stacks. I hope that helps in upgrading your project to RapidWeaver 8 or recovering your old website.